So Jeremiah, how are you? Doing good, are you? Good, good, good. So, you know, I know everyone's feeling good about the defensive performance the other night against Memphis. You know, Coach Gus said Alfred thought it was the best defensive performance of the season. Uh, what do you think after, you know, reviewing everything? Was that one of your best performances this year? Uh, yes, I'd say that for sure. You know, we did a great job stopping the run and put the um, Memphis in passing situations to pass the ball. Do you feel like this is the game you guys can build off of into your second half of the season? Of course. Always giving us confidence going into the next week. Earlier in the season, you know, you missed a couple games. Uh, do you feel like you're back in the full swing of uh, what's going on there up front? Yeah, of course. <laughs> what are you seeing from Temple on film? Uh, they like to take a lot of shots, a lot of, uh, let, a lot of jet motions and stuff like that, but we haven't finished uh, breaking film down them all the way yet. Jeremiah, how much has tackling improved? I know it's kind of been a team-wide issue since the beginning of the year. It looks like that's improved the last few games. Like, how has that improved, you think? Uh, tackling it improved a lot defensively, you know, just as, instead of taking all the big shots, just make sure you tackle it down and get it down on the field, on the field to play the next play. Jeremiah, Devontae Brown got his first career interception. There's a lot of young DBs, obviously, Brandon Adams making starts as a freshman, and, you know, we know about the other guys, but what do you like about those guys and what have you seen that, from the growth perspective? From the DBs, man, I've seen they, they, they're growing a lot. Like, Devontae Brown, he's been playing with a lot of confidence and a lot of, like, besides to him. Like, he, he may not celebrate, but, you know, like, he played a lot, like, with a lot of confidence. You know, another person, uh, BJ31, he's been doing his thing, too. He's been balling, just confidence. You might just mentioned BJ, and he's a true freshman. I know we, I don't know, we asked you, but we asked a lot of guys during the preseason in August, we're like, who's looking good out there? And they all said, Brandon Adams is standing out. I know it took a few games to get going, but he's been starting, like, what do you see from him just, you know, since, since the summer for him to stand out so early? From the summer, I mean, he, he's been a hard worker from, from the summer to now. It's just showing out, like, all the work that we put in the summer together, defensively, it's just all showing right now throughout the season. Team is 0-3 on the road. What do you think explains the struggles away from home? Uh, I wouldn't say anything about struggling. I'd say, like, for this upcoming week, we know we play away, but us being 0-3 on the road, will be something for us to, like, that's a mission for us to handle. Like, going up to Philly will be a mission for us to win this week on the road. Jeremiah, talking about going up to Philly, you know, you get to play in a few NFL stadiums. You know, obviously, USF is one. Temple's another one where the Eagles play. Do you, you ever, like, kind of look around before the game and just kind of, you know, this is where the NFL guys play, right? Uh, yeah, I look around, but, you know, I really be locked in on the game, making sure we get things done. Halloween's coming up. I know you guys are going to be focused on the game, but it's on Sunday. Did you have any like any favorite Halloween costumes growing up? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of uh, Spider-Man and Batman. Okay, I got it. <laughs> UCF, as we know, has had outstanding offenses in recent years. This year, kind of a work in progress with no Dylan and whatnot. Do you put more pressure on yourself as a defense to try and step up the game? Obviously, you want to do well every time out there, but is there a little bit more pressure knowing that you might not have that kind of cushion from the offense? No, nah, you know, defensively, we like to focus on our tasks. We do what we do. We, we let the defense do what they do. We let the offense do what they do. But at the end of the day, we're a team. So we play collectively and we play together as a team. Thanks, Jeremiah. Thank sure. you. Good luck, man. Good luck.